as a landowner, we are very proud to help our country and the world to have a cleaner future. And going the next 20 years, we are very excited to see where this wind farm will go to. Valit's family has been farming this area for the last 140 years. We bought Nels Spurky in 1999 and we moved from Bluefontein to this farm in 2001. Jerry came to us in 2010 about developing a wind farm here. UV's vision is for 100% of energy generation to be sourced from renewable energy technologies. Projects that we develop are developed over a long period of time, so we have to develop strong trust relationships with the landowners. Developing projects is important. It involves finding a site, measuring the wind resource over an extended period of time. But one also wants to check that the construction is not, for example, going to have adverse effects on environmental um, impacts. But more than anything else, the owner needs to be interested in what they're going to get from this. The biggest benefits is the financial uh, decision that you make. The, the, it cannot compare to what you can make out of, of, of small stock farming. All those turbines are on, on one property. So the revenue that comes through from a maximum size wind project in South Africa is certainly substantial and, and life-changing. The landowners of, of Kharob have this guest house Nels Purki on their property and it was there before we arrived but it's substantially grown over the development period of the project. As landowners we protect the land so our biggest concerns were the construction phase, a portion of land that they will use for construction but at the end of the day it only consists about three to four percent of the total land used. As much as we have built the wind farm on, on, on his land, it does not disrupt his day-to-day -day, um, activities. It's particularly rewarding when we see the wind projects being built on, on landowners' property to see the property transformed into what's effectively an energy factory that's producing this clean energy and deriving revenue and attracting interest and, and effectively starts a whole new parallel business for the, the landowner. I'd love to see a lot more pieces of, of land like Harob getting transformed for the pure reasons that we need uh, renewable energy in South Africa. So it would be in line with the, with the program to improve our energy resources. UV's hope for the future is that we realize our vision. That being that energy supply is provided 100% from renewable energy sources. Our long-term existence is dependent on it. I think the best life investment that we as a family make was to allow or to approve the build of a wind farm or renewable facilities. I think it's very important for us as landowners that everybody benefit out of this project.